Today our examples will be finding inverse of a function. Finding inverse means find the image on the y equal to x line. So finding inverse means exchanging x and y. So we have x equal to y square plus 5 and then x minus 5 equal to y square. Therefore we have to find y which means y equal to plus minus square root of x minus 5. We write square root of plus minus whenever we write the square root. That's it, inverse of this function here. And then if we do the other example here, finding inverse means isolate x and y. Uh, isolate the y after exchanging them. So exchange x and y. Instead of y we write x. Instead of x we write y plus 1. We isolate something with the y, so I bring the one the other side, x minus 1 equal to square root of y minus 3. We square both sides in order to find y. If I square the square root, I get y minus 3. Isolate y, y equal to x minus 1 square plus 3. And that's inverse. Inverse symbol is like f minus 1 inverse symbol is f minus 1 so f minus 1 okay so that's the inverse this is the inverse just by exchanging x and y we can find the inverse okay that's it